Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Let's Draw with Maddie Frost, episode three, Party Pops! <laughs> we are celebrating my dog Mozzie's birthday. He's turning five. Mozzie, can you say hello? Oh, hello. So grab some paper and something to draw with and let's draw, guys. <laughs> Okay, my friends, let's draw these party pups. First one I'm gonna draw is a little pup sitting. So I'm going to start with my pup's head. Okay, just a little oval there. And then the body will start from the bottom of the head. Like that. Okay, and now I'm going to put in some ears, and I always think the ears kind of give your pup some character, so I'm going to put the ears pointy like this, so maybe it could be like a corgi or something, or I don't know, some dog that has pointy ears. So... I'll just pretend it's a corgi and I know that they have like this white mark in the middle of their face so I'll just kind of put that there and a nose I'm just gonna draw an upside down triangle shape and then I'll color it in and then I'll do his little mouth mm-hmm and this could be his little extra little part there and some marks there. Some eyes. Oh, he's looking cute. Okay, how about the inner part of the ear? Mm-hmm. And some arms here. So I'll do like number 11 here, number 11 here, and then the little paw. It's like the little W or three U's. Oh, he's so cute. Okay, so for the legs, I can kind of just, the back legs, I can tuck them in like kind of like this. But we need his feet. So I'm just going to draw feet coming like that. Cute. And then how about maybe there's a little tail back there wagging. <laughs> and ooh, maybe I'll give um, my pup a little collar with a tag. <laughs> and since he's coming to the party, I will have to give this little corgi a party hat with a pom-pom. And maybe you want to add a little pattern to your party hat. Do some little stripes. Cute! And I'm going to name this pup Piper. Woof, woof. All right, my next pup is going to be a poodle. There has to be a poodle at the party, right? So I'm going to start with this cloud shape like that and then I'm gonna draw almost like an ice cream cone underneath it and I will put in some eyes and a nose 
a little smile. <laughs> it looks really funny right now. It looks like a smiling ice cream cone. Um, okay, and then kind of like how we did the corgi body, we'll do the same kind of like similar shape, but we're just gonna add a curvy line, so. Okay, okay, great. And then let's do some little arms. So we'll do the same kind of thing, but instead of making a straight line, we're just gonna make it cloudy, like a cloud and some little paws there. Cute. And since you guys totally know how to do those legs um, sort of behind there, you can do the same thing on the poodle, but just make the line puffy. And you can add a little foot like that. <laughs> and this pup really needs some ears, so you can make them super big if you want. Super cute. <laughs> really cute and then a tail can be wagging a little line looks like a dandelion or something oh cute and then maybe there's you can add a little bit of extra lines to show how fluffy this poodle is and this poodle definitely needs a party hat, right? So party hats on everybody. Cute. And then a pom-pom because definitely, right? Because it's a poodle. And instead of stripes, I think I will do a polka dot pattern on my party hat. Oh, cute. Okay. This pop. I think will be named Toby. Toby the Poodle. Make the nose a little bigger. Oh, so cute. Great job, you guys. Ready, it comes a ball. Next up, I kind of want to draw a, like more of a bulldog. So to do that, I'm going to start with the shape of the head, kind of like a circle. And I'm going to angle this pup sitting down, but not, but sort of more, his body will be more at an angle. So let's put a line right in the middle of the circle going, in the bottom of the circle going down. And then this will be his back, like that. So he's kind of sitting, but to the side, but his face is looking at us. You see that? Okay, great. And let's do, let's do a line up like this. And then for the nose, I'm going to do a one, two, three shape like that. I'm gonna color it in. Cute. There's lots of different ways to draw a dog nose. I mean, you can just put a dot in if you really want and it'll still look super cute. And let's draw the mouth. And bottom part there and some little speckles cute and how about some ears so I think I want to do some triangle ears since it's sort of a bulldog oh well, I'm gonna color them in Mm-hmm. And some 
cute little eyes. I'm doing dot eyes. They're just as cute as doing the eyes with the pupils like we've done before. And I think I'm going to draw like a little shape like that. So maybe when I color my bulldog, I can do a different color on this side of his face. So that looks cute. Let's give this pup some arms. So I'm going to actually do one of the arms sort of coming out a little bit like this, a little bit in front of him, and the other one just next to it like that. Boop, cute. And then for the leg that's bent, on, uh, because we see the side of it, we're gonna do a backwards letter C, like that. And then, well, it's sort of like a C. It's more of like a crescent moon kind of line there. One, two, three. And then you can just bring it, connect it together like that. And of course, you can erase these lines if you're drawing with pencil. If not, don't worry about it because you're just practicing, right? So we can look however you want it. And a little tail, maybe it'll be, it'll be like a spot back there. Oh, cute. And then maybe on his back too, I think I'm gonna have a big spot. And maybe one here. Yeah, definitely. Cute. Okay. And I definitely want to give my pup a party hat because he's definitely going to be at the party. And for this pattern, I think I'll just do some zigzags. <laughs> oh, so cute. And this pup's name is Bear. He's just so snuggly. Looks really snuggly, doesn't he? Great job, you guys. Excellent. Good one. Now I want to draw a puppy sleeping. So I'll start with the head like that. Then the body will go up, come around, and kind of go and meet this line here. Okay, and some closed eyes. A little puppy nose. Mm, he's smiling dreaming about treats and I'm gonna make some uh, floppy ears and I kind of want the ears to look like they're just sort of flopped down in his bed so I made them a little curvy instead of just straight down Um, but you can add your own kind of ears on if you want. Just what I felt like doing. Okay. Then I'm going to put the leg in. So these legs, when they sleep like this, go, that's like his leg kind of bent. And then you can kind of just do that for the foot. Maybe there's a couple of little toe mar marks there. And a tail could be curved around like that. I'll put some little toes tucked in underneath. 
cute. And I think I want to give this pup a bed to sleep in. So I'm going to start kind of right around his butt. It's a butt. And connect back like that. But it doesn't, it kind of looks like he's sleeping on a mat. It doesn't really look like a bed. So let's add a little bit of dimension to the bed. So I can, I'm going to start here and I'm just going to add like the front part of the bed. It'll just give it a little bit of dimension there. And maybe I'll add a little bit of like cushion marks. He's weighted down in there. And you could write a name for your doggy on the puppy bed. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll just write Mozzie. And put happy face because I have extra room. <laughs> oh, don't forget, it's got to be sleeping, right? I'll put a party hat on him. He's just so tired from his party. And I will do some zigzags on the party hat. Just too much fun had at the party. Oh, and maybe I'll add some little fur lines. Cute. Cute, cute. <sighs> Great job. Thank you guys so much for hanging out and drawing with me and celebrating my pup Mozzie's birthday. I know he had so much fun. Did you have fun, Mozzie? Yeah, come, get a treat. Ah, yay! You guys did great. Thank you so much. I hope I see you next week for some more drawing fun. And if you want to know more about me and Fozzie, you can visit my website at maddie-frost.com. Bye guys. Thank you. <laughs>